Hey guys, Justin Parnell joined by Michael Majors again for day three Wednesday of our Mini Masters versus. Now, yesterday you were able to tie it up. I won. That means you picked today. <sighs> I picked today. Okay. Well, I went with a Planeswalker yesterday. Did not work at all. Didn't. I am going to choose Angel of Invention. I was trying to think of the name of that. What what card is this? That is Demon of Dark Schemes. Mm, all right, I'm going to go with Demon of Dark Schemes. That is without a doubt the most powerful card we can open. If you can find you a way can to cast, cast it. it. Yeah. If you can find a way to cast it. As we found out yesterday, that is that is the rub for the format. I don't have much faith in triple format. casting cost cards. I do not either. All right. All right. Token. This land. Land. Rare to the front. Everybody gets a taste. I have a foil. Ooh, a foil. That means I need to one more down, right? One more back to front. Okay. Here we go. Yeah. Okay. All right. We good to go? Yep. Is Got that a good one? All right. I think they'll never tell. They're just the worst. Just let us live in fear and confusion. Told me I had a foil. Got really excited. It was a foil planes. <laughs> All right. All right. You gonna cut me this time? Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna cut okay. you. After that, after the last one. I'm on the play. I swear if I have your Ori again. I won't cast it this time. That was a one time deal, viewers. Oh man. Now this is not something that happens often, but I feel based on the strength of this right here, I'm forced to keep. What could possibly go wrong? <laughs> This is a great card, but we are literally two land types away from casting it, and this card is probably dead. So I think we should just mulligan. All right. Feeling good. About, I'm feeling good about this one. Feeling good about this one. Maybe I'm supposed to just keep. I don't know. I imagine that this is the card that I want with the rest of what I got going on. So we're going to keep it and see if see if the uh, the deck gifts me with something. You're good this time. Okay. Got to switch it up. Six cards coming. Okay. Um <laughs> very convincing. Okay. Not okay. not great, <laughs> but we can cast the other great card from our hand. There you go. Last see? hand. Yeah. Okay. So, well, so something to look forward you know, to. It's in there. We know it's in there. Exactly. All right, so I'm going to take my scry. Okay. Oh, that's a that's a dope foil right there. I mean, you just got to keep it. Well, all right. You're up. Go. Okay. All right. What eluded me last game. Here we are. Go. Oh, whoa. Yep, I'm bringing the heat Ooh. this time. Okay. That is that is a powerful card. All if right. we have black mana. <laughs> if you have black mana. I'm not seeing what they do. Wow. Now, I'm so incredibly jealous. I'm going to get this island. Look at the discipline there. He didn't even, he didn't even look through his whole deck. I don't need to. No need. No need. Knew what I was going for. I, I can appreciate you wanting to keep the spirit of the game yeah, alive. Yeah, I mean, this is, this is why we're here, to not know what is going on. Only the viewer knows. Your turn. Okay, I'm at 17. That guy hits awfully hard. <laughs> reckless fire weaver? Say, no, not <laughs> reckless fire weaver. All right, I'm gonna pass the turn. Okay, not not exactly no, what I expected. Not but... not what I expected either. <sighs> wow, that's a great draw. It's really exciting. Um, I'm getting punished for this. Not whatsoever greedy keep. I'm just gonna gonna hit you. Okay, I'll, I'll Thir take it. Thirteen, 13. It is. All right, we're gonna bring the terror to the fairgrounds. Okay, that's uh. That's something. Something going, to do. Going gremlin on you. All right, I'll draw. Okay, so this is not this is not panned out. I want to play a noble inventor. When he enters the battlefield, I will draw Nimble card. Inventor, he's not noble. He will nobly block on your turn though. I'll okay. Pass the turn. I'd love to draw land. Any land will do. That's probably the worst possible. <laughs> a card we can't cast. His his body is ready. <laughs> Attack. Just that guy? Just that one. Yeah, I'm, I'm not going to block that. Right, I'll your turn. Draw. 
All right, this is why we kept the hand. It's coming. We had you have no, all five just, colors. We just had natural natural domain. Okay. No artifacts, but no artifacts. He is a uh, two two all the same though. I'll pass the turn. All right. All right, we're Land. locking it up. Oh gosh. Well, you know, to? let me tell you, folks, that's not a land. <laughs> it's not a land. <laughs> okay. Um, I was I was feeling better about two turns ago. I'm not gonna lie. I can't block with this guy, so we're gonna attack. Yeah. Well, this is it's time now that we have an additional blocker. Your turn. Okay. Draw. I'm still feeling okay. Any land will play. All right. We are going to play a Plains and an old Iron league Steedy. Okay. We'll put a Servo into play. All right. I admire the safety of your play. Yeah, well, you know, I am at 10. I am at 10. It's true. We'll, we'll offer it here if you're interested. And if not, I can respect that too. It's not clear that things are really getting better for Terror of the Fairgrounds. <laughs> he he is he is much more imposing in your hand than he is in play, I've found. Yeah. So given that, I think I'm just gonna go ahead and take the trade. Okay. That's that seems fair. Which does turn on my scrap heap scrounger in theory. It oh yeah, in theory. In theory. Once you get that swamp that there may or may not be in your deck. I'll pass the turn. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> All right. I will play. My old faithful workshop assistant deal you a point of damage. Nine. Your turn. Really shutting down your offense now. You are. You are. All right. I'm going to play Island. Now. I don't like that your rare is still available. It is still available. Oh, that's We're a play great Tezzer's card. Ambition. It is a great card. I have four. We're going here. I feel like you're likely to discard lands. We're going here. Well, I control an artifact. I'm not discard nothing. Oh, you don't discard if you have an artifact. That's, that's right. I'm gonna keep just draw. I'm three. gonna keep black red up. Just, just, just draw three. One, two, three. How was okay. it? It's, you know, it it looked like a, uh, a booster pack of Kaladesh is what it looked like. <laughs> so plus fifteen I'll lands. Pa I'll pass the turn. Yeah, pass the turn. Come on. Okay, there we go. That'll play. Now what do we do? Guess we'll just play the best card in our hand. It's Cloud Blazer. <laughs> best card in <coughs> in both of our hands. Okay. You go to 22. Picked up some nice ones there, too. Your turn. That was, and look, look who has domain now. All right. It's not the worst possible thing in the whole world, I suppose. That does leave a lot of room. It does leave a lot of room. There's, it could could be anything at this point. Okay, it's not bad. It's not. It's not bad. Let's tap it like. You'd so. love to attack, right? Uh, you know, maybe uh, maybe in my higher life total days, <laughs> but. That's not where we currently are. So, man, you're at 22. Cloud Blazer, that's just, ugh, ugh. I'll pass the turn. Okay. Now, as, as much as I would really like to cast this card, <laughs> it's, it seems sweet and all. I think I should just build my board this turn. Definitely not offering the trade Cloud Blazer, because I think that can get better in the future. So I'm just going to play my Malfist squad. I'm going to make a servo, deal not, damage to you. Not a bad one. I'll go to eight. And then I will pass the turn. All right. Well, untappy. Draw. Yeah, there are a lot of those in the deck, aren't there? Planes? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Little of everything. Or a lot of everything. Yeah, I'm going to pass the turn. All right. I'm going to exile this terror, return scrap heap scrounger, there he is. deal damage to you. Seven. Seven. Okay. <coughs> Card didn't work out well from our opponent Strap last game. Scrounger. That is... You still have your rare available, too, which I just realized. Oh, that's right. 
Because mine was foil. I'm, I'm going to need to draw mine, and I'm going to need it to be the actual Demon of Dark Schemes. Okay, I'm just going to read this card in my hand, which is the rare for the record, for the <sighs> third time. It's kind of tricky. Right, I think we're, we're just going to get aggressive here. All right. Have at it. I'm going to appetite for the unnatural this. Oh, boy. All right. Built to last. All right. It's indestructible, it right? It's indestructible and plus two, plus two. So, turn. Okay, so I'll gain two life. You're going to gain two. Go to 24, 24, as though you need it. The rich get richer. And let's see. I was really hoping to eat up old, old Cloud Blazer with that, but... I don't think... We should make an attack now. Oh, you, you, want, you want to get aggressive. What happened to that? <laughs> I did. All right, we're, gonna, we're just going to play this Midnight Oil thing. Oh, man. Okay. That's pretty good. So I get seven counters. Okay, so we're going to have to mill you out again is what you're telling me. And I draw a card. Pin your draw step, draw an additional card, and remove two hour counters. Your maximum hand size is equal to the number of hour counters. Whenever you discard a card, you lose one life. Yeah, so if you mind rot me, I take a bunch of damage. And we your turn. are again going for mill. Okay, let's draw. All right, all right. Well, we have two of everything. So there's that. <laughs> okay. Hopefully my rare was progenitus. <laughs> which still might not win me the game. Yeah, take a couple hits. Yeah, yeah, just a couple though. I'll pass the turn. All right. So I remove two hour counters and draw an additional card. Yep. That seems awfully powerful. Okay, I guess first things first, we'll try our luck at Glintness Crane. Okay. I have a feeling, Ooh, I have a feeling you're going to hit. I didn't, and I got past two good cards, kind of like okay. you last time. Okay. Um, I think this is better than that, so we'll do that. I was just not putting mine right on the bottom. That did not work out for me. And we're just going to go ahead and make an attack. Yep. So if I attack with these three, you're basically forced to double this and jump here, go to four. So if I attack with my servo two and this, <coughs> go eat, double here, four, five, six, go to one. So I could just send everything if I really well, wanted to. I don't have to, to though. Think about it. Um, what's the worst that happens here? Probably eat, eat, chump, go to one. It's a pretty bad spot for you. <laughs> it's, it's not good. All right, I'll attack, not good. attack with everything. Everything? All right. Yep. We're going to go here. We're going to take out Cloud Blazer and... Not destroying any artifacts. The workshop assistant and go to two. Okay. So we'll trade. We'll go to two. Your assistant will bite it. I'll play a very dangerous night market lookout. Yeah, it is a dangerous one. When and you're at two life. Go ahead. Okay. What if you had Fumigate? Oh, man. That would be something else. That would be something else, and then you'd kill me over it. Well, I'd get a little bit of life. No, the Scrappy Scrounger would, would get pretty aggressive. Man, so I drew my rare. Okay, so it's not but, Fumigate. But we're in, <laughs> we're in a too little, too late situation. It's a good it one a too. Good, it is a good one. Yeah. It is it is a good one, but it is not it is not right now. It is not very good right now when uh, when you're at two life. Maybe I want to tag. All right. Well, we'll get we'll get some energy. Maybe you want to tag. That's true. Maybe I have commencement of festivities in my hand and was trying to trick you. You seem like a really tricky dude. Well, you know, that's what's it's all we got to work with at this point. I'll pass the turn. All right. Draw two cards off my Midnight Oil. Keep on burning it. Can't actually cast that one. Oh, God. 
All right. Talk about everything. No, I'm super <laughs> Trigger night mark. Look out. Oh, man. Core Prowler. Still had a land left. Essence Extraction, I would have enjoyed that, as would I have Hunt the Weak. That would have been... Oh, yeah, both those are great. Yep. These are the two cards I put on the bottom of Glint Nest Crane. Those are... This is a this is a powerful card. It is. It's a powerful card. Here's that Inspire Charge I can never yep, cast. Yep. <laughs> I don't think... I will make a prediction. No one will cast Inspire Charge. Ever. I think you might be right. Yep. If you've cast Inspire Charge at home in a Kaladesh, in Kaladesh Limited, that is the last time anyone will ever cast it. That's my prediction. Oh, man. What could have been? I feel like this deck could have done it. I kept Domain in my opening hand. You just gotta have... You just gotta have... You gotta have the mana. The different colors of mana, so... That Scrappy Scrounger really went yeah, the distance. Yeah, that is a... And uh, Cloud Blazer. Those are powerful cards. Yeah, for are sure. powerful cards. Almost like you got three rares. Yeah, it kind of was, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, Cloud Blazer, it's, uh... You know. It's a good one. I've seen, I've seen worse cards. I've, I've seen worse cards. All right. I'm down in the hole one two, despite yesterday promising a victory. It did not pull through. There's still time to redeem yourself. There's still time to win the series. I have to win the next two. I I, I don't know. That's that's what I gotta do. We'll find out. We'll find out. We'll find out tomorrow. For Michael Majors, I'm Justin Parnell, and we'll see you guys tomorrow.